Ever wished you could edit your photos like a pro without spending a dime? Well, now you can. Introducing Google's Nano Banana, a revolutionary AI image editor that lets you transform your pictures effortlessly. Whether it's swapping outfits, changing backgrounds, or adding fun elements, Nano Banana does it all with stunning consistency. And the best part, it's completely free. No hidden fees, no tricks. Stick around and I'll show you exactly how to access it and start creating magic with your photos. Before we dive in, make sure to hit that subscribe button and give us a thumbs up if you're excited to explore this game-changing tool. Let's get started. So what is Nano Banana? Nano Banana, officially known as Gemini 2.5 Flash Image, is Google's latest AI-powered image editing tool, integrated into the Gemini app. It allows users to make precise edits to their photos, such as changing outfits, adding props, or altering backgrounds, all while maintaining the original subject's consistency. This advancement addresses common issues in AI image editing, ensuring that faces, poses, and details remain true to the original subject, even after extensive changes. Now, just in a minute, I will show you how to get an access completely for free to Nano Banana, but here I will explain to you guys why you should use Nano Banana in the first place. Now, point number one is consistency. Maintain subject likeness across multiple edits. Point number two is multi-step edits. It allows for complex layered changes to images. Number three is user-friendly, designed for both beginners and professionals. And number four is that it's actually free to use. You don't have to have subscription. Now, let me show you how to get an access completely for free to Nano Banana. So here you will go to this link. I will also put a link for it in the video description below. It's called Google AI Studio. Make sure that you actually are signed in with your Google account to this website. And now here on the left menu, you will see this option called Generate Media and this new option, which is Gemini Native Image. Character Consistency Image Generation with Gemini 2.5 Flash. You can click on this and then just click on X here. And then here you can see here the temperature. So basically this means that creativity allowed in the responses. Basically you can crank up this up to two, but I will leave it to one. Then if you go here down below, you will also find a few more options like safety settings and also output length. I will leave every single option here as it is. And now we can do something insane. For example, here I'm gonna click on plus. I'm, I will upload a file here and I will upload this image of this guy. So we can put this guy here to Google AI Studio. Here we have this guy pretty much with which is holding banana here in its hand. So here I'm gonna ask it add a very nice background to this image, maybe clouds and mountain river. And here we have this image without actual background because it's transparent. So pretty much it will hopefully add this exact description to this image. I'm gonna click here on run. And as I mentioned before, this is all completely for free. Of course, here you will have token count on the right corner here. You can see that you have 32,000 tokens to use. So pretty much we can see here the current model response. Now, in my opinion, it does not look that good here. As you can see here, it did actually generate here the mountain river here. However, this guy is somewhere in the middle of the image and it doesn't look that good in my personal opinion. Now we can try one more thing. I will upload this image once again. So for example, here I will go to upload file. I'm gonna select this same image. And now here I'm gonna ask it remove banana from his hand and add a car instead. So just like this, remove banana from his hand and add a car instead. Click on run here and uh, let's see what will happen here with the nano banana. Now here we can see that this nano banana did actually quite a good job changing the banana for this toy car in his hand. So I'm quite impressed that this actually here worked. Now here I'm gonna try to add background once again. So here I'm gonna ask Nano Banana add a simple living room in the background. And I'm gonna click on run and let's just wait for a few seconds here. By the way guys, if you are enjoying this type of content, do me a favor, smash up the like button on this video and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Now we can see here that it added this guy again here to this image. 
But in my opinion, the same as before, it does look better. However, it still does not look as natural as before. And we can see also here that it has this watermark. So one thing which I will try here is to upload this image again. So here I'm gonna go upload file, select this the same image here and I'm gonna ask this AI or Nano Banana modify this text on his t-shirt to a writing I love New York. I'm gonna click on run and let's see what will happen here with Nano Banana. We can also see here how many of the tokens I actually use for a few of the images here. So just a few images and we are already used here 7,000 tokens as you can see. Now you can see here that it added also a background so this is something that I didn't ask for Nano Banana to do. However, it did correctly here change its writing on his shirt. So from AI to I love New York. I think this is quite impressive, to be honest. Now here, one thing which I will also try is to modify this shirt. So for example, modify this shirt to a hoodie instead. So just like this, modify this shirt to a hoodie instead in bright purple color. So just like this, I'm gonna click here on run and let's see what Nano, Nano Banana will actually do here. So I think this, this is really impressive from Google that they released here this uh, Nano Banana out of the blue and it's able to understand the context and also change this context very, very nicely. We can also see here that it has this simple menu here on the right where you can navigate among the edits very, very nicely. So here we can see this new image it does have this bright new purple hoodie on instead of a plain white t-shirt. And we also have here this writing, I love New York. So I think that it works super nice. Let's change also his color of his eyes. So for example, we can change here, change his color of eyes to blue. So just like this, let's click on run and let's see what will happen right now with Google AI Studio. By the way, guys, if you're browsing without a VPN, you're actually exposed. NordVPN protects your data, hides your IP and gives you access to content worldwide. And right now you can get 70% off with my exclusive link in the description. No complicated setup, just fast, secure, private internet the way it should be. Click the link, grab the deal and start protecting yourself today with NordVPN. And here we already have the result. So instead of the brown eyes, he has right now the blue eyes, this purple hoodie and also this new writing on the hoodie, I love New York. I think that it looks super, super nice. So here I will go here back, click on plus. I'm gonna here upload file and here I'm gonna click on this guy. Now here I will upload another file, which is this uh, background and also another one, which is this cap. Now here I'm gonna put in this prompt, make this guy wear a blue cap in the woods. And here I'm gonna click on run and let's just wait for a few seconds here. And now we can indeed here see this guy wearing this blue cap, which I provided in the woods. And it also gave him the legs as well and also the shoes. So overall, I think that this image indeed looks really, really nice. Let's also take a here a look at it. So for example, if I open it here, we can see that this is really, really impressive for Google's Nano Banana. It combined every single image I gave it to it and we have here the end result. So pretty much everything combined. And it also looks here very, very natural because this guy also has this shadow from his legs here, as you can see, and it works super, super well. Of course, we have here this watermark at the bottom right corner, but nevertheless, this is a free tool which understands the context very, very nicely. Now, in my personal opinion, I'm quite impressed with this free nano banana tool from Google. I think you should definitely give it a try and I will also put a link for it in the video description down below. Now with that said, make sure that you smash up the like button if you enjoyed this video. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already and uh, I will see you all around guys in the next video.